6759 Rancher over here in 07. We're also like kind of at the end of a little uh, cul-de-sac type thing here. Good part of 07. A lot of ranchers in this neighborhood. It's got to be really easy to find comps. Off street parking. Nice driveway. Roof looks decent. Need windows. Brick and siding look good. You see that doorknob? Our keys work on that one too. So if there's like one silver one and then there's a multiple like gold ones like that, go for the gold. Really nice backyard here. And it looks like we push up to a park of some sort, which is nice. Probably rip down that shed. So this is beautiful back here. Um, a park of some sort. So that's nice. Looks like we have a, a little porch, probably needs to be demoed. Siding just needs power wash and the roof is, it's green, but it's, it looks decent. Definitely need windows. And uh, probably a new unit as well, looks a little rusted. So as we walk in, we have a, a little wooden ramp here. Little soffit and gutter work there. So walk in, we have drywall and baseboard and trim. So this is our living room. Our living room is 13, 13 by 17 too, and right behind that wall is our stairs going downstairs. So we can open up the, in between the dining room and the kitchen, but not the living room and the kitchen. Our dining room is 13, five, nine, five. Kitchen as it sits, 11, eight. 11, eight by eight, 11. Full bath on the main, baseboard. Hmm. Ah, tile's close. It's questionable. Um, looks like we have some leakage from the roof, probably. So three bedrooms here on the main. Drywall and baseboard. Nine five by ten ten. Need windows. Drywall trim is good. Get rid of the baseboard. Bedroom two on the main, 11. 11 by 12, five. Metal windows, so we need windows. And baseboard, get rid of the baseboard. Drywall looks good. Bedroom three on the main, 13, four. 13, four by 13, three. Drywall is good, need windows, and we have baseboard. And it looks like we have plumbing for a half bath in here as well. Stand up, sh I'm sorry, a full bath, stand up shower. That's perfect. Three, two on the main. That's great. So three, two on the main. Perfect. So we have a three, two on the main. And in the basement, we're gonna get a measurement at the joist. Okay. So literally right like that. We're looking for like six, eight or higher. This is seven, six. So beautiful ceiling heights. And then we want a measurement of the whole basement. This is a full footprint of the, of the house, which gotcha. is really good. So this is 24, two. <coughs> 24, two by 40. So we can obviously do our living room, bedroom and full bath down here. Looks like we got 100 amp. The wires are still in good condition. Let's check this foundation. We, got, we do have some mold here, some demo. One room already framed out. Some more mold here. Get rid of that framing. So pretty much a blank slate here to do, do uh, what we need to do. So take a look at this. This is going sideways. 
which is not good. Right. So when, when you see it going sideways for that long, right. definitely get that on the tape. Gotcha. And then when you see it start to separating, like okay. you see how it's like coming out a little bit? Yeah. That's bad. So, um, yep. Yeah. So we have some foundation stuff going on here, which is we know how to fix this. We just need to know about it. Right. Yep. Yeah, so just make okay. sure that's on the video. It's 